But speaking of things that I didn't totally expect to see, but I am now excited to see, Universal Champion Kevin Owens will be taking on the Goldberg um, this Sunday at Fastlane. Uh, they had a they had, once again a lot of talk, a lot of posturing, a lot of feather feather fluffing, and all of this uh, when Kevin Owens confronted Goldberg this week. A number of Twitter exchanges and pettiness abound. Kevin Owens just seems petty. And especially without Chris Jericho, it's not cute. It's not fun. It's just petty. Goldberg also seems to be without anybody kind of on his team or supporting him. He also seems to be playing into being a petty kind of person. Does Goldberg really want this Universal Championship? Do you get a sense from him that he cares or finds this title prestigious at all? Or does he just want to take something away from someone else like Kevin Owens? Just because he's an easy target. A little bit of both. I would say that maybe not for the championship. I would argue that he wants the money that comes along with the championship. He came back in the first place. Not only because he adored the fans. I'm sure that was a part of it. But because more matches, more big wins. Like the big win that he got over Brock Lesnar a few months ago. Means more money for his own family and kids and his wife. So on and so forth. And going on to WrestleMania in that big match with Brock... His name is already in the dotted line. It's already been signed on the dotted line. That match with Brock Lesnar is already set in stone. But walking into WrestleMania and all the promotion that goes into that, as the Universal Champion, the spotlight is on Goldberg. Everything that goes along with that is huge for Goldberg and his brand. With Kevin Owens, and to me, that's just very one-dimensional. I like Goldberg, but with Kevin Owens, it goes a lot deeper. And you had said with, with, with Chris Jericho, with Sami Zayn, Kevin Owens is a cowardly man, a very cowardly man. Every time someone shows any sort of affection towards him, he turns his back on him. He stabs him right in the back, and he says, I'm a prize fighter. I only love my kids. I only love my family, my wife, and I'm going to do it for me. I'm going to do it for them. I'm not going to do it for you, Jericho. I'm not going to do it for you, Zane. And that's what this match is all about. And he does not want that reign to come to an end anytime soon. Yeah, I, in fact, if anything, I view Kevin Owens as a hoarder. Once he has something, he just wants some more of it, but he doesn't want you to touch it. Yep. You know? Exactly. And he, he guises all of the – he puts it all out there that, you know, he's doing this for his family, which I believe, and that he is, uh, you know, doing this because he's always wanted to be a champion and now he's at the top and he's the best. And I just don't he, – he's been handed everything. It's well documented how he has risen to power here. Um, and – now that he is finding himself going up against real competition, Goldberg, we've seen him go against Braun Strowman. We've seen him start to have to enter this high peak WrestleMania season of high competition. Does Kevin Owens have what it takes without the help of Chris Jericho, the United States champion who we have not seen in a few weeks now? Uh, does he have what it takes to beat Goldberg here? And especially this was a match set in motion by none other than Chris Jericho. Um, I say that there's a lot of things here working against Kevin Owens, and a lot of it's his own doing. What are the chances that we see Kevin Owens retain? I think there's a better chance. I told you last week I was more confident coming out of the week prior. Um, I mean, I think every week since this match has been announced, I am more confident that Owens will walk out on top. I will say my official prediction is still Goldberg winning the championship and then going on to face Brock Lesnar at WrestleMania. But the more time passes, the more of a chance I see for Owens retaining his title. Just because, as I had said, we had not seen this Kevin Owens since NXT two, three years ago. This dark side of the prize fighter that will, will, that will literally do anything and everything it takes to walk out victorious and with that championship intact. So I think Owens has a pretty, he has a fighting chance, no pun intended, but I think Goldberg does walk out the new champion. 